Hello and welcome back to Ease on the Road. I'm your host Steph and today I'm going to show you how to make an easy poblano vinaigrette. We're going to start off by adding one roasted poblano into your blender. A small bunch of cilantro, two tablespoons of pineapple vinegar, one tablespoon of lime juice, half a cup of olive oil, one teaspoon of coconut aminos, one fourth of a teaspoon of ground cumin, half a teaspoon of black pepper, half a teaspoon of salt, and now you want to blend until smooth. Oh yeah! Woo and boom done! Once you blend your ingredients, you're going to add one roasted and minced garlic and half a tablespoon of Mexican oregano. Using a salad dressing little jar like this, very vintage of me. And if you guys want one like this, Cloud will link it in the description area for you. And you're just going to pour your dressing right into your jar. And boom, done. Time to make a delicious salad. Once you're done blending and pouring your dressing into your favorite little container, you're going to let this sit on your counter for two hours. Do not refrigerate until all those flavors are well combined. You're going to see a little separation and that's okay. You can always shake it up. And you start assembling your salad with your favorite vegetables or ingredients. I'm going to add some carrots. Don't give me that look, Cloud. <laughs> You've turned me into a fan. Yay! <laughs> some cucumbers. I'm going to add some black beans. Corn. And some chicken that we grilled over the weekend. Yummy. You just want to shake it off, shake it off. That song just never gets old, you know? <laughs> And then you're going to pour your delicious poblano vinaigrette. You get a little bit of a sweet tang from it, but you don't want it to be too citrusy. It's just perfect if you're using pineapple vinegar. But if you don't have that, use apple cider and it's going to be a little bit more tart. Oh, I can't stop. I'm just pouring. Ah! <laughs> and you can add some of your cotija cheese. And boom, done. Who's ready for a bite? I'm going to need somebody very special to say ah. Uh... If you're looking for a little bit of spice from your vinaigrette, you can add a roasted serrano jalapeno or a chiltepin, blend it, and boom, done. But other than that, this is a very light dressing. It's super digestible and easy on your tummy and just delicious. The flavor of the poblano really does pull through with this recipe, so I hope you guys enjoy it as much as I do. Mmm, that's so good. And you'll have to excuse me, once I start with the salad, I just start munching, and this is a perfect salad. Make sure to get some grilled chicken. My mouth's salivating, you have to excuse me. But the chicken that I used for this particular salad is from the chicken out of it, and I'll link that in the description area. Mmm. And I hope you guys are enjoying my take on delicious, healthy recipes. Look away. I can't seem to put this salad down. As always, Cloud and I are wishing you the best. We absolutely adore you. Make sure to subscribe, comment, and like. And if you're enjoying these healthy recipes, we're going to need more thumbs up. And on that one, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Adios. I love pumpkin seeds. Ladies, you need to add them to your salad. So go ahead and sprinkle a little bit on there. I almost forgot to show you, but I want to make sure that you guys are eating your pumpkin seeds.